Hello friends, welcome back to my video. Sorry I look like this, I've been kind of burning the candle at both ends. It's going very well. Before we start today, I'm super excited to announce that we have our very first sponsor on the channel, ExpressVPN, baby. Are you scared of other people finding your search history on the internet? Well, me too. I'll talk more about it at the end of the video, but there is a link in the description or comments where you can get a subscription to ExpressVPN and get three months free and I can pay rent. What do you need a VPN for? I don't know, but I've heard you can do illegal stuff. This is TikTok Tuesday, the series that is a series. <laughs> Let's go. Let's talk about stupid people for a minute. Let's. Behind me is Highway 9 in Black Mountain, North Carolina. And the stream that you saw over my shoulder is a stream that comes out from a cistern in a mountain stream. Being as how I operate a North Carolina state approved drinking water analysis lab, we've tested the water out of this random fucking pipe. And every single time we test this water, <laughs> it tests positive for coliform, and most of the time, E. coli. And yet hippies, idiots, and morons from all around, like the car parked behind me, and the car that's right there, venture out here to collect the water and drink. The water mm. comes out of a pipe, past the caution tape, and into the cistern, into the woods. And it flows down here. We've posted signs that the water is contaminated <coughs> with coliform and E. coli, and yet people keep drinking it. You literally can't make it uh. stop. just keep drinking the water. If that's not the very definition of stupidity, I really don't know what is. Where was that? I'm kind of thirsty. This is my impression of Patrick Starr when, yes. <laughs> when Squidward I love this joke. Like, shoves that trombone up his ass or something. I don't remember <laughs> what happens. <laughs> <laughs> Black English Explained. Part two. And in English, there are three tenses, past, present, future. But black English actually utilizes a fourth tense known as the occasional tense or the habitual be. Whereas the I first three tenses are used to indicate that something has happened in the past, something is happening in the moment, or something will happen in the future. The occasional tense is used to indicate that something happens sometime. <laughs> he be dancing. Don't mean he's dancing in the moment. Don't mean he gonna be dancing next week. But he do be dancing on occasion. The I do be. B can also be used to assign a trait to a subject. So if somebody was like, yo, I gave Travis $500 six months ago, he said he was going to pay me back, and I ain't seen a dime, then I'm going to be like, and you probably never will. You shouldn't have <laughs> gave him any money. You know Travis be a lie. You see, this indicates that Travis is a liar, known for lying, and you shouldn't have trusted his lying behind. And now you going to end up on Judge Mathis. Why? Because <laughs> he be lying. It's very informative. I um, I learned a lot. So I'm going to explain to you why the Confederate flag you know today is racist, and I'll do so without uh -oh. the motivation of the Civil War as a reason. When the Civil War ended, people didn't celebrate it. It was an embarrassment. You didn't yeah. go into stores and find Confederate memorabilia. But in 1948, Harry S. Truman, the Democratic president, moved to integrate the military, and Southern Democrats didn't like this. They were already fighting to keep Jim Crow laws and segregation alive. So they broke off and they formed the State Rights Democratic Party, also known as the Dixiecrats. It's the worst name ever. So they needed a symbol to represent their cause. And what did they pick? Not one of the national flags of the Confederacy, but rather a battle flag that most today know as the Confederate flag. Now, they were short-lived, and Strom Thurmond and a lot of those other Dems ended up becoming Republicans. What a name. The propaganda around that flag and having Southern pride stuck. Now, you can get it on a blanket or a trucker hat, but understand it only exists in pop culture today because it represents people of color not being good enough to eat at the same restaurants, swim in the same pools, or drink from the same water fountains as whites. It is literally a symbol of hate. What a just monumental unit of a man. That was wonderful. <laughs> Like your cat. <laughs> <laughs> Jimmy. <laughs> oh, Jimmy's so hot. <laughs> I'm fucking crying. <laughs> oh, fuck, there's someone here! <laughs> Jimmy! <laughs> oh, dear Lord. I just wanted to stop. I don't like when you call me your boyfriend. I don't know what that word means. <laughs> I don't like when you call me All right. your boyfriend. Even though 
we slept together for a thousand times and I gave you an STD. I don't know what that means. What's a responsibility? I'm not your boyfriend. It's a banger. What's a boyfriend? Really? What's a boyfriend? That was, yeah. Yeah, fuck. Next, we have the Walmart accent challenge. Number one, please insert cash or select payment type. Number two, your receipt will be dispensed below the scanner. Number three, please take your change. What four, the fuck? Unidentified item in the bagging area. And number five, thank you for shopping at Walmart. <laughs> uh, okay. <laughs> Look at where California is going to have to ration water. Oh, no. You know why? Because they send millions of gallons of water out to sea, out to the Pacific, because they want to take care of certain little tiny fish <laughs> that aren't doing very well without water, to be honest with you. But uh, it's, uh, <laughs> it's a very sad thing that's happening. It's Please go vote. Please. I realize this may not be important, but in that tweet, the second L is a capital I. Why the fuck did he do that? Why ever? Here's Saddleback College. Cole Hirsch Let's again. Let's face it. Our mascot, the Gaucho, is racist, and it's time for him to be murdered. Anyway, I have just the idea for a new progressive mascot for your school. Her name is Titty Pussy, and she's a woke, sloppy goblin girl who rides around the campus on sweat-stained roller skates and begs each student to come out as bi. If a student refuses to do so, Titty Pussy will let out a shriek that has the frequency to change the student's body hair to strawberry blonde. Then Titty Pussy will say, Tough break, Straighty. Have fun Tough break, out Straighty. Thumb, should you ever visit a beach in Palestine? <laughs> At sporting events, instead of displaying kiss cams on the Jumbotron, Titty Pussy will instead screen promos for her OnlyFans, which mainly consists of her getting off to the school flat. During halftime, Titty Pussy will do her signature dance move, the pop lock and swap it, where she'll make the team swap mouth guards to reassure the fans that none of the players are homophobic. <laughs> If either team refuses, she'll take a knee for the rest of the game, uh, right in the middle of the field. <laughs> you got this, buddy. No, he's gonna make it. <laughs> oh shit. <laughs> oh shit. Here, bear. He just went right into it. You okay, where are you? Gravity changed on him. He's mad. No. Come on, buddy. What's that no. yell? Come here. Do cats make that sound? No. Come here. No. Come here and let me dry you. <laughs> Dude, that sounded like a fucking skinwalker. Hey, sure, Joe Biden's a neoliberal shill who's been in office too long and is frustratingly pragmatic, but at least he knows how the government works and he's been in the military and stuff. Yeah. Um, oh, and he didn't... Kill 210,000 people by lying about the coronavirus and not doing anything about it. Um, and he doesn't encourage white supremacy. Uh, this is oh. not a politician, guys. It's really not. Yeah, I'm sorry for all the political TikToks, but again, we're like a little over two weeks away from the shit show that's about to happen in November. I just some ah fuck. Hey, yo, Winston. Winston. People want some bars, homie. I'll start you off, all right? Oh. oh. <laughs> Dude, I want to feature him. This is what type of bird too he is behind me. <laughs> and he also bonks like that. <laughs> this is so much force. There is only one video that lives in my head rent free, and it's this one. All right, well, you got a pretty good balance. There. Thank you. Uh -oh. I want you to step, bump, step, bump, bump, step, bump, step, bump, bump. All right. Five, six, seven, eight. Step, bump, step, bump, bump, step, bump. <laughs> Step, bump, bump. Pot of beret. Kickball change. Step, clap. Okay. Five, six, seven, eight. <laughs> you know what would be good is if you hit kicked and then you kind of <laughs> did that and then a barrel turn and then ha. You know? That was, that was good. That would be 
That was no. really good. You a dancer? No. No, no, no. Not a, I'm, I'm just drunk. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, uh, yeah. That's it for this video. I hope you didn't like. I hope you didn't like it. Like I said, we have a sponsor for this episode. It's really cool that we're finally getting big enough for that. And it's also just crazy that they were like, this guy. <laughs> There's a link down in the comments or description, whatever I feel like. If you click it, it will take you to ExpressVPN's website where you can get three months free on a subscription to the VPN. Having a VPN is basically like wearing little condoms on your finger <laughs> when you're on the internet. They're really good. I'm joking. I use one all the time. You can watch fucking Canadian Netflix. They've got good movies like your name. If you haven't seen it, watch that. You'll cry. And if you do happen to get a subscription, it does help out the channel. If that's something you want to help, <laughs> I'll get better at this or maybe I won't. That's your problem, ExpressVP. <laughs> Make sure to go check out our new series that I started on Sunday called Spooky Sunday. Read some scary stuff, a little bit of an ASMR voice. Kind of. I learned a lot about how I'm bad at ASMR, but good thing for me, I didn't really try. <laughs> the little clickable video in the outro will take you to that video. Leave a comment, let me know how to make it better. I really want to keep doing it. Make sure to join our Discord. If you want. I do reply to every comment I get, so please leave one. I'm a little behind right now, but I'm behind in life. <laughs> I'll get to you. Subscriber down, thanks.